The Grand Canyon, characterized by its distinctive layered bands of red rock, stands as one of the most famous natural formations in the United States and the world. Recently, a team of experts made a discovery set to revolutionize our understanding of its history. Today, we'll examine 10 intriguing discoveries made by scientists in this incredible place. If you're here for the first time, subscribe to the channel by clicking the notification bell and leave a thumbs up before starting the video. Number 10. Strange Prehistoric Life Forms In the Grand Canyon, an extraordinary discovery was made regarding ancient life forms. During a hike, geologist Alan Krill noticed strange traces on a rock and sent photos to colleague Stephen Rowland, a paleontologist. From the analysis of the images, Rowland deduced that they were fossil tracks dating back approximately 313 million years, the oldest ever found in the canyon. It is believed that these tracks belong to reptilian animals, perhaps amphibians, preserved by sand. Roland observed that the marks depict two animals crossing the rock diagonally. Number 9. Caves with mummified sloths and bats In the Grand Canyon, there are little-known caves rich in remains of plants and animals dating back to the Ice Age. These caves vary in size, some so narrow that they require entry on all fours, others large enough to allow easy movement. The animals that inhabited them include wood rats, bats, birds, and even now extinct bighorn sheep and sloths. Thanks to the dry climate of Arizona, the remains of these animals have been exceptionally well preserved. Fossil analyses have provided valuable information about the Ice Age, with particular attention to Rampart Cave, discovered in 1936. Here, sloth dung has been found, providing valuable information about the environment and diet of these creatures. The cave also houses skulls of Harrington's bighorn sheep and mummified bats, well preserved due to the region's dry climate. Number eight, the Colorado River is drying up. The Colorado River, originating in the Rocky Mountains, stretches for approximately 2,330 kilometers through spectacular landscapes, including the famous canyons. However, researchers have discovered that the river is rapidly dwindling due to low levels in its major reservoirs along its course. Dams built to divert water to growing cities have reduced the flow into the river, causing concern among environmentalists. The Glen Canyon Dam, in particular, has sparked controversy with environmentalists calling for an update to the system to ensure adequate water flow into the Colorado River. It is essential to act swiftly to protect this unique natural resource before it's too late. Number seven, spiritual site for tribes. The Grand Canyon is sacred territory for several Native American tribes and is now threatened by the presence of uranium mines outside its boundaries. These mines, active since the 1950s, focus on geological formations called breccia pipes. Despite a temporary ban on uranium mining on one million acres of surrounding public lands, native communities like the Supai, who rely on springs within the canyon, remain concerned. However, with around 600 active mining concessions still near the Grand Canyon, urgent measures are needed to protect this precious natural resource. Number six, the Mogollon Monster. Also known as the Bigfoot of Arizona, the Mogollon Monster is one of the most intriguing legends of the Grand Canyon. It is said to reside in the dense forests of the Mogollon Rim, a 600 meter high cliff that stretches for miles. The first sighting dates back to 1903, when explorer Ingvald Walter Stevens described it as a Bigfoot-like creature. Don Davis, a cryptozoology enthusiast, also recounted an encounter in the 1940s. Despite Stevens and Davis's accounts, many scientists believe the sightings to be false or possibly a large standing grizzly bear. However, if you ever hear a blood-curdling scream or encounter unusual footprints on the Mogollon Rim, it might be the feared Mogollon monster ready to emerge from the canyon woods. Number five, the luxury cave suite in the Grand Canyon. During the Cuban Missile Crisis in 1961, John F. Kennedy built a luxury suite in the Grand Canyon as a refugee. 
in case of nuclear bombings. Located 120 meters below the surface, this cavern contains caves and walls dating back millions of years. Kennedy provided enough food to support over 2,000 people for a month. Although there was never a nuclear threat, the suite is now a tourist destination. Thanks to the dry climate of the Grand Canyon, emergency rations have remained usable even after decades. However, the suite is one of the attractions of the National Park and requires a nightly fee of $900 to experience. Number 4. The Terrifying Creation of the Grand Canyon The formation of the Grand Canyon is an extraordinary story that began approximately 70 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. Initially, the terrain was flat, but due to tectonic activity, it gradually uplifted, setting the stage for the creation of the canyon. About six million years ago, the Colorado River began to carve its path through the rising plateau, exposing a vast array of geological formations that tell the story of the Earth. As the river eroded the layers of sedimentary rock, climate changes influenced the rate of erosion. The presence of harder rocks contributed to the formation of the towering cliffs and steep slopes that characterize the Grand Canyon. This natural site continues to be shaped by the Colorado River, offering visitors a vivid testament to the dynamic forces of nature and the Earth's geological history. Number three, the case of disappearing and reappearing bodies. In 2021, a body was found in the Grand Canyon about 131 meters below the Yavapai Point Rim. It was presumed to belong to a 45-year-old Hungarian man named Gaba Berksy Tomsonyi, reported missing to the Las Vegas police by his family. During the search, the body of another man, Scott Walsh, last seen in 2015, was also discovered. His body was found nearly five kilometers away, blending in with the surrounding environment. No one knows why authorities did not find these bodies earlier. Recently, a box-shaped structure was discovered during the search for further mysteries in the canyon crevices. This object has sparked great curiosity as it could contain ancient secrets or revelations about the Magoyan monster. However, due to concerns and fears surrounding the box, it has never been opened. Would you have the courage to open it? Number 2. Tusayan Ruins In the Grand Canyon area, Many creatures have lived unique stories over time. Among these are the ancient Puebloans, considered relatives of modern Hopi, Zuni, and other tribes. The Tusayan ruins, a few miles from the southern rim of the Grand Canyon, date back to AD 1185. According to juniper tree rings, these ancient dwellings testify to human presence over 800 years ago. The ruins include a central plaza, storage rooms, dwellings and kivas, ceremonial structures still used by the Puebloans. Archaeologists, with permission from the National Park Service, excavated the site in the 1930s, leading to the creation of the Tusayan Museum, which preserves the history of the Native American tribes that inhabited the Grand Canyon area for centuries. Number 1. The Havasupai People, also known as Havasubaha, reside in Supai, an affluent canyon of the Grand Canyon. They are among the smallest Indian nations in the United States and are known to receive mail via mule. Originally, they moved between the Colorado Plateau and the Tonto Trail depending on the seasons, engaging in hunting and cultivating corn, beans, and squash. They live in circular shelters and to avoid nightmares, position their heads on mattresses facing east. They had no contact with European explorers until the arrival of Spanish priest Francisco Garces in 1776. Currently, their economy relies mainly on tourism, agriculture, and wage labor. Even today, our journey has come to an end, but it will not be the last. Don't forget to leave a like, a comment, and to subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed the video. Until the next adventure.